Hey everybody, what a weekly. I don't know how to feel about it yet. Not negatively or positively, like I'm having a lot of fun. I'm just confused because uh, I had a run go to round 21 last time and I only got seven wins. It's like seven wins, five losses. Nine draws consecutively? Anyway, I'm honestly, you're going to turn me into a hater. I think the moth is just, I don't want to say bad because that opens me up to potential criticism. Instead, what I'll say is that I think it's not good. It'll be a sour cucumber. They should come up with a name for those. Um, I, I think buying it is like, what a squad. Um, it, never mind. It's like an admission that you just want to draw. Because when you buy it, you... Don't frick me on this one. You fricked me. When you buy it, you tend to like one for one. So what's the freaking point? I am asking you. Like you're buying something just to hopefully, or maybe maybe it hitting a cockroach makes sense. I don't know, man. Maybe we gotta this whole. T I, I, you know what? We're working on a theory, okay? That's what we're doing right now. We're theorizing. It's very complicated. I wouldn't expect everybody to understand it. Maybe cockroach and moth. Makes sense. Maybe that's our cockroach and ladybug from last week. I don't know. Dromedary. Dromedary buffs your shops. I'm, I'm betting on a level two ant showing up at some point. Two dromedaries. It's a second. I don't think he's heard of second dromedary, Pip. We're going to sell our moth, even though that was like we, were, we said we were testing to see if that's part of the plan. You should know by now that I can't back that up. Um, I don't think we'll win this. I think we'll probably lose with a small chance of a draw and an even smaller chance of meatballs. Wait a minute, though. Hold on. We just won this. And now we're going to have two, two buffs for our two most left, two leftmost pets. Cheap chick in the city. Um, raccoon. It's a 5-4. I would keep you around for a moment, just a moment. I'm, I was just gonna say, I'm really feeling like we got another level coming up soon. So what if we just created a super raccoon? And then pill you and don't hit the cockroach. Don't, don't embarrass yourself by hitting the cockroach. Not interested. Not even close to interested. I don't want to take a crab just to take one. I'm actually going to buff our dromedary, and I'm going to take the L. We probably shouldn't have pilled the ant this early. Um, I got a little ahead of myself. I thought I was doing cool stuff, and it turns out it was not that cool, unless uh, by cool you mean it sucks. Hey, what about freezing a tamarind right now? That's a great idea. So I think an 8-7 raccoon. We can be proud of it. And then we take our level. And then we get a mantis. I love a mantis. I think a mantis... One of the most disrespected and... I'm going to become the Joker. Um, one of the most disrespected and underrated units in the game. No joke. I'm going to buy an otter. It's, it's kill fodder. You're a piece of junk, man. Just kidding. That was unfortunate, though. Um, the otter is kill fodder for next turn if we need it. And we're going to start buffing up this, uh, this stork here. Maybe the stork's got a shot, you know? We're gonna win this one. As, as bad as this run, like, some of the dice rolls have gone for us, and as bad as some of the decisions have been, I think we got a squad that has some... They got some potential. Obviously, we'd love to see a turtle. If, if we don't, though, we'll be happy garlic exists. I'm not gonna kill you for a random pet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep you around. I mean, it's double the stat points. I'm gonna. It, it, that's perfect. That's. I couldn't have asked for more than that. Thank you so much. We'll keep the stork at the back, I guess. Mantis is is a. I think scaling seems somewhat harder to come by this week. Having something that scales itself to this degree, it it appeals to me. I'm not gonna pretend it doesn't. But also, how are we gonna beat these summon teams that are inevitably gonna show up pretty soon? That's a great question. I don't really want you to give honey to everybody. That scares me. I would say, give me my buff. That also allows the mantis to keep going off. You could summon a bus. <laughs> I don't think that's uh, super relevant. But it's some, I don't, this doesn't seem like a weekly to me, at least right now, where you can just make one 50-50 and be like, oops, I won the game. 
I'm stealing your garlic for no reason. Um, seems like you gotta do a little bit better than that. So I don't know, one mantis is not gonna do it, but that's also not the mantis's fault, you know? But I would like to have some more, I guess more of an identity right now. And honestly, I hate to say it, as of right now, you should kill the stork. We're not, we're not really taking great advantage of it. Our raccoon can also go, I guess, to set up a, a pivot next round. Cool, let's keep the deer popping off. We definitely would like a turtle. I also feel like I would like, um, I was gonna say a lynx, but I don't really think we have a great lynx squad right now. We don't have a, a lot of levels. Things are gonna get scary pretty quick. We gotta, I mean, I'm, I'm a little nervous. That's so unfortunate for me. That's so unfortunate. That's so, that's so unfortunate. You know what, what are we at here? Six life? Four life. Functionally exactly the same. Now that we're losing three hearts. Okay, what do you got for me? What do you got for me? A deer, maybe? Another man that is insane! That's unbelievably good! Right. Um... <laughs> we do have four life. It does feel like a chicken team can do something, right? Like a combine? Bye. Bye. And I apologize to the deer on this one. Because the next step would be not losing this round and then allowing your chicken to pop off. And I recognize maybe you look at this and you say, what about that lion? Some sense and sensibility there. There's a second chicken. I don't know if he's heard of second chicken Pippin. Well, even though we're giving the melon to the dromedary, we would, in order for this team to make any sense, we would be selling our dromedary at some point to fit some other stuff. Tenacious B, great name, great name. Honey Badger user spotted, great name. There's a lot of level ones there. This is very exciting for me. So you gotta go. You gotta come out here. You gotta come out here. That's gonna be a second free roll. And remember, you can just kill the last unit that shows up. Now, the dromedary no longer looks that impressive. Send an otter out there, absolutely. Like, the dromedary could easily go to create something else. I mean, like, a tamarind looks fun, don't get me wrong, but... I honestly... 9-8 melon armor? I would sell you to buy an 11-11. That makes our future shops that much better. Apparently, I'm not going to purchase a can, even though it seems like, why wouldn't you? Now I'm looking at this team, and I'm like, is this good? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like one decent unit is not good enough. Yeah. We're going to be on lethal. But let me stop you right there. On lethal is where you expect to be when you start your chicken pivot. That's not unusual. Now, I think you need this, even though it's an expensive buy. Two chickens. You gotta love it. Roll me. No tier ones. Really? A tier one. But also, <laughs> a death touch. A permanent... That's probably... I would say there's more meat on that bone. Okay. I don't know. This is maybe not that good. Sorry, I briefly, I thought we were being burgled briefly, but we're not. Don't kill me. I'm so happy we bought the lemon, man. As soon as I saw our opponent with the fly, I knew the lemon was, was the right play. With garlic, I think, we feel free to run the math on this one, but with garlic, I think we lose. I think it's a little late to put a shark on the squad, sorry to say. I don't even know if that's good. <laughs> I feel like the lemon did us a great service last time. I'm, I'm just, I feel like at some point we're going to need to combine chickens, but maybe, maybe we don't do it yet. Because, like, you're, you're just not that strong right now. That's where I'm at. You're a little dookie. Like, I, I think it has to happen. We roll once. You're tier fives. Okay, so that won't work. But I think right now, this is like your bailout point. Kill the moth. Sell the beaver next turn. Run an orca up here, just because it's like a good unit. It's, it's a 21-24 with, with good, like, after effects. Not to adobe pill everybody, but... Okay. It's a very strong lion. That's a little spooky for me. It's not that strong. 
Are we navigating the, the hills and thrills of a chicken build with acceptability here? I feel that. I feel that. So you're going, we need to find a way to level you up because you're just not doing that much. Or, or we got to get rid of you and say, like, we'll never forget about you. But at the same time, like, we got to get some stuff going here, you know? We got to get some stuff going. This is a great purchase, by the way. Because you're going to give everybody plus two attack when you die. You're another orca. You're cool. Okay. Um, Nacellar beaver. Second orca. I don't know if the or I'm buying you because you got good stats, okay? That's, that's my deal. There we go. Now the chicken is viable again and we can triple down on the chicken build. Nobody's got any equipment, by the way, except we got a big death touch up at the front. Is that shark killable? Can this shark be killed? I think it can be killed. I, I know it can be killed. You just got killed by a hedgehog. Seven wins. Okay. Get iced. Everybody gets some support. I don't know why I put it there. Should have bought this first as well. I'm very, I'm very silly and I'm very sorry. Why don't you get out of here? You did your part. Tier one for next time. And another little, another little dude. We could, st I mean, we're on lethal. It doesn't take that much to kill this squad. Like, overriding a piece of equipment would hurt a great deal. We've gotten pretty lucky so far that nothing has really even come close. And our squad has held up very well. And it, it seems to just be getting better. I love a viable chicken. I disrespected the chicken for a long time. I love a viable chicken. Maybe it's been viable forever and it's me that's changed. Mm, I don't know. It doesn't seem likely. I'm pretty old. And then we have to send you out here. How do you guys feel like in balance terms about a three cost unit that's 34, 31 and gives a friend death touch? I think that maybe they, oh, it's, it's not uh, overpowered. It's just cause I'm running the, the greatest strategic team of all time. You didn't have to say that. I would have loved if that had hit the other. No, it's all okay, it's okay, it's okay. Okay, now do you just, do we need lemons for the whole squad? Is that where we're going with this now? It's just, it's, it's a lemon squad. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. You shouldn't have. Look, we almost outscaled the Mantis with the shop. <laughs> That's something special. At this point, I'm like, dude, honestly... I don't want to send another Mantis out there. That would be, like, chaos mode. But I don't think we really need to focus that much on the shop anymore. Like, I, I'll freeze you for now, but I'm, I'm kind of like, oh, we should have frozen the other lemon. We'd have everything frozen, okay? I don't know. It, it becomes harder to figure out where I'm going with this one. This is fine, though. They got to fly at the back. Hold on. I'm looking at a team that actually scares me a little bit. It's scaring me a little bit? It's not scaring me that much. It's it For a bit, I was uh, was afraid. I was petrified, etc., etc. I think we may draw. No, we may just win. We may just smoke you. And then we if we're on... Oh, that's 10. <laughs> I got so invested in the chicken build, man. I didn't know where we were going. I, I was like, now we got to focus on just getting to 10 wins. Turns out, mission accomplished accidentally. I, d I just don't like I just don't like you. I'm sorry. I think the beaver is, is purchasable. And then, are you, now I'm like, okay, let's test this theory, okay? Let's, let's try moth cockroach. Even though it's just guaranteed to lose. Let's be a peculiar package. It's guaranteed to not lose, but to one for one our opponent's moth team. They didn't go moth. It's mutually, mutually assured destruction. If I take a moth, you have to take a moth. Because if I don't take a moth, my moth's going to kill your moth. How does that make you feel? Okay. Right. You guys like Austin Powers? So that's unusual. Um, I don't even know if that's good. But I do know that there are bisons in the pack. 
which, and here's the moth you will assured destruction. Um, if there's bisons in the pack, I'm never going to complain about getting an early chance at a level three. Well, this strategy fell apart fast. Bisons in the pack. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you guys like the doors? Bisons in the pack. Forget that camel. I sleep. Okay, where are we going? I don't know. We got a 7-7 seven, seven frontline unit and a bunch of ants that will buff. That's not... <laughs> you will... But they got more mods. That should mean that I'm in a better position. But it clearly doesn't. What? Okay, maybe the rest of their squad was better. I would say just take your level. We, we gotta... We're gonna put a bit of a rush on. Ooh... Okay. <laughs> I like this. Stork's probably sticking around. Let's give us some extra support. Hmm, hmm. It's still early. In the early game, I think, you know, the shops were still figuring out what's going on, okay? But that was basically moth really assured destruction. We're going to win this one. I really, like, usually I look at a run and I go, I know exactly how we're faring right now. Right now, I have no clue. I think it depends on what shows up later, for sure. Like... Aardvark has seemed pretty strong, but I really, I really, I really want to roll for a level. I really <laughs> would like to roll for... This is a, a very pivotal moment um, where a level would help us out a lot. Or any match, really, would be okay. That's fine. Okay, it turns out a level was useless. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it like that. I know we missed the chance of the double level up, but... I'm gonna do it like that. The cockroach has gotta go, but we have other fish to fry first. Holy cow, they didn't have a moth. You know what that means. We're moth to the races. Nope, that's bad. Never mind. Okay. Are we on lethal? We kind of deserve to be, I think. All the units are bad, the shop's bad. Roll me. We don't want any more moths. We'll take another stork. Why don't you get some buffing for the future? I'm going to give you some meat just because I want you to stand a chance. I, 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 we can't afford to lose this one. It's changed our optics. Our time horizon has changed. We're no longer thinking about the long term. We're thinking about right now. Okay, that's horrendous. The rest of their squad has meat as well. So that squad is built to kill. Great name, by the way. And great band. Randy describes eternity. This is bad. I think we're in prayer territory. My prayers have not been answered. <laughs> mm, my prayers have been answered. You're gone. You're in. We do have to run half squatted here. That's a scary thought. And by half squatted, I mean 80% squatted. Just draw. That's it. You just got to draw. This seems potentially drawable. The, the level two turtle is the greatest get I ever could have asked for. Thank you so much. And we got the scaling on the bison without waiting. Take a garlic for support. Take a shark just because you do something. And then we can start building towards a summon team. We could sell our cockroach. <laughs> you piece of crap. You think it's That's the worst part about it is that you think it's funny. There we go. That's So now we're in the same situation. We're going to pray that we don't die again. And we're going to start building towards a summon team. We're not scaling very fast and none of our units are that impressive. But there's something to it now. There's a little, a, a je ne sais quoi, if you will. What are you summoning for me? This is a big one. Something useless. Okay, not the way I would have done it. But look at this. We still win. What do we have? Four? Four wins. Okay. We're going to start to run into some pretty tough squads soon. You've got to go. Can't sell you. You've got to come in here. You've got to come in here. You could probably move up to the front now just so you don't get killed by someone else with chili pepper. 3 HP? You know me. I would... Uh, level 3 stork! Holy cow! Okay. Um, you know what that means. Now we can pill our ants get the stats and add another fainter to the squad. They're building a they're building um 
they're building a bus team? Which is scary for me, because just to have that level of ambition is... There's gravitas associated with it. But we made it through, probably because they deliberately sort of handicapped themselves, which they probably did on purpose. I, I want to pill you. If I cannot pill you, and we could take two of these, but I'd much rather just get an Orca going, okay? Because they, they should be showing up next round. So I don't want to invest in something with no future. I'm just going to roll a little bit. I'm going to... We need lemons, actually, too. Okay, you're gone. You had your chance to get the buff. Now we got two faint triggers. Forget the HP for now. Forget it. Now we want an eagle on the squad as well. I would absolutely try something like this. I do wish that I bought more cans earlier in the game, but so be it. I'm going to give you honey for now because we got to live. But in the future, we would like to give you a one-up. And then you've seen this squad before. My eagle, my orca, my streamer, my sun and my stars. Khaleesi. That's great. That was an insanely good turtle. Thank you so much. What do you got for me? 15-6 eel. It's useless. It's bad. I'm crying. I'm living. And we're winning. Okay. Big plays. Lemon for my shark, please. No, okay. An eagle. Thought about the chili. Don't get me wrong. I, I thought about it. You know what? This situation can me shark me. Still don't think we're scaling fast enough, but you never know. We could get some good matchups. Strong lion. He's strong. He might be stronger than me, but he's not that strong. That garlic's pretty strong, though. I'm not sure if you've noticed that aspect of it. An eagle. Okay, the orca spawned an eagle. Beautiful. What's happening? I don't know what's happening anymore. <laughs> <laughs> You're overriding my garlic. That's very unfortunate. But look at this. I'm wait. You've got a 50 HP hardmark back there. I got no chance. Who was letting me say this idiotic stuff? Like I'm pretty sure I got this. I didn't even see that aardvark, man. That's a terrible matchup. Game over on turn 11. Still a fun one and a fun video. Hope you enjoyed yourself as much as I did. This seems like a fun weekly. I'm lost in the early game. I can no longer shop happily, but then in the mid game, we got some crazy stuff. Viable chicken, sharks, uh, shark summon team with an aardvark counter. Oakland face with a Brooklyn booty. You know what I'm saying? LA face with an Oakland booty. Is that how the song goes? I don't know. I'm making up my own lyrics now. Hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. See ya.